A warm welcome to all those taking part in this course. My task is to present this training course in regards to the methods used. We have endeavoured to create a training environment full of operative and theoretical stimuli that is also encouraging and innovative in its methods. The underlying idea that guided us in the creation of this course was that of the making the most of the experience that each of you has accumulated at the Salesian Polytechnic University and to build new challenges around it to update Don Bosco's methods in favour of young people. We are aware that any idea is at its best incomplete and can always be improved. This is why we believe that, to better meet the educational requirements of our times, we must work together in a spirit of collaboration. The whole team that has participated in creating this training offer ensures its active and constant participation to all the phases of the activity. Well aware that the training targets will be achieved at their utmost only by constant interaction, even if from a distance. With this objective in mind, we have prepared an offer that is both flexible and customizable. The course has three objectives. The first is to initiate a deliberation on four great pedagogical tops amongst a group of teachers. The second is to form a group of teachers that, at the end of the course, will be capable of sharing their expertise in guiding their colleagues in educational organizations. The third is to start up the actual production of lessons and resources, distinguished by methodological innovation and by the efficient integration of teaching technologies. The four training modules are offered in three different types of activities theoretical analysis study activity, dialogue and exchange of opinions activity, active experimentation activity. In the analysis area, various materials organized in lessons are available. Each lesson is introduced by a brief video that illustrates its principal contents. Each teacher is required to analyze the contents to the extent needed to take part in the dialogue and active experimentation activities. In the exchange of opinions and dialogue area, you will find forums, wiki, websites and chat rooms all connected to topics covered by the module. This area requires active participation by all. Knowledge can become a heritage of the entire academic community only if an extensive debate is started on important topics. In the active experimentation area, all teachers must get together to create activities and experiments with their colleagues in their specific fields of knowledge. This is the most challenging area of the entire course and is partly implemented in web environments dedicated to each field of knowledge. This is the area from which we are expecting the best results for the academic community. Supported by remote tutors, each teacher will have to measure him or herself with the active experimentation of the pedagogical and didactic fundamentals offered in the various modules. I will now present the promotional module. The module is made up of a structured individual deliberation space in which each teacher can meditate on his or her pedagogical skills, on what he or she has learned and on his or her individual professional progress. This space offers tools for self-assessment of skills and to analyze one's own teaching and learning style. Each teacher will also be invited to describe, in a specific space, the most significant products he or she has created in the active experimentation area. EduLife. Learning to grow together.